What is going on guys, K here from KB's Gaming today, back with some more Pokemon Omega Ruby. In the last episode, we fought the... Hmm. We fought the gym in the last episode, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm losing my, my episode counts. Then we came up and we fought our way through this route right here. Um, PD9000 died in the battle against the Windstraight family. Um, so that happened. And we caught Hishi, which is our Machop. I got it up to level 22. It's like an inch away from level 23. It knows Karate Chop. You guys were waiting to find out the moveset since last episode. So it knows Karate Chop, Knock Off, Revenge, and Seismic Toss. And then we have K-Clutch. Uh, he didn't learn anything new. Fear the Curt, level... Or K-Clutch, level 27. Didn't learn anything new. Fear the Curt, level 26. Didn't learn anything new. C-Clutch, level 28. Learned Scary Face, which... Excuse my finger. And I tilted that a little bit. Um, the user frightens the target with a scary face to harshly lower its speed stat. Uh, Dreamer, level 28, didn't learn anything. And then we have HM Slave. HM Slave is going to be around for about another 10 seconds. He's going to be useful for a while. But now we can catch another new thing. And the good thing is this is going to be either a fire and ground type. Or this is going to be a straight up fire type. I hope it's just straight up fire. Okay, okay, I'll take it. I will take it. <clears throat> Numel, Camperrupt is still good. I was hoping for- Oh, it's a female again with the he-she's. Um, I was hoping for a, uh, what's it calls it? A Torkoal. I was going to name it Raphael. <laughs> Okay, let's try using a move, just in case this thing hasn't- well no, we'll throw an Ultra Ball. I bought a bunch of Ultra Balls, 10 to be exact, in between episodes. So, I also talked to everyone, got all items, etc. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! What are we gonna name you? Hmm. What are we gonna name you? Oh, he, she leveled up. Level 23. Let me move that back some, just in case that'll help the, uh, the glare on the camera. Numel. Numel is extremely dull-witted. It doesn't notice being hit. However, it can't stand hunger for even a second. This Pokemon's body is a seething cauldron of boiling magma. Give a nickname? Yes. Um... Hmm... No, I'm not gonna call it that. No, 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 no. Um, Camperrupt. Female Camperrupt. Female Camperrupt. Um, how do you put it? I know, I'm taking forever, I'm sorry. Hmm. I named it Great She. You'll see why I named it Great She in... Great! She has been transferred to a lie. <laughs> oh, this is gonna come in handy later on in these next episodes or we could have caught a slugma i i kind of want a slugma now <laughs> i don't know if we'll ever have the chance to catch it again but i kind of want that now instead of new mail it's too bad we can't have it but i mean i would have been happy with slugma or Torkoal. and battle i knew this was gonna happen <laughs> Oh no, we're gonna have to wait till we get to the next town to switch out. Because we need HM Slave to get past these rocks right here. Stupid storyline freaking BS going on down here. We'll just kill this Geodude and go on. He, she, got a little bit of experience. Okay, let's just go back. There was no point to that. Sorry, great she, but... 
Uh, I'll put the punctuation to it. Sorry. Great! She has to wait. <laughs> Meh. <laughs> um, she has to wait until... <laughs> Avoid. We can catch another... Wait. This. What route is this? Route 112. That's one route... 117... Yes, we can catch something on this route. It's probably gonna be another new mole. But... It's gonna be another new mole, I already know. No, no, it was another he-she. Okay. Well, we have another route. We have a bunch of freaking routes that we can catch stuff on coming up. So we're just gonna wreck this he-she. It's actually a he-she, too. It's a female machoc. We're gonna wreck this he-she. And then we're gonna go on with our journey. We're gonna fight... Should we fight that trainer first? We'll fight the trainer first. Well, no, 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 no. I'll come back and use him for experience when I put the next Pokemon in our party. I'll also come back and get those berries. Now we're on Route 111. We have to fight this guy. Show me how much you toughened your Pokemon. Ace Trainer Wilton sent out Electric. <laughs> he, she, it is time to demolish. We'll lead with knockoff. Oh no. Okay, that didn't do as much as I thought it was gonna do. Okay, it wasn't holding anything. We'll use revenge. I think revenge works kind of like retaliate does. If revenge works like if God damn it. If revenge works like if you do damage, then I do twice as much damage after going next. That's kind of like payback. Yeah, that would make more sense actually. I was gonna say. Oh, we'll have fear the curb take care of this one. Oh, he's about to level up too. A level twenty Bagon. I don't like the way this thing's looking at me. It's only level twenty, but a Bagon is intimidating. Okay, it only knows headbutt. Dragon Tail one shot though. Nice. Okay, uh, that thing was intimidating a little bit. I was like, oh, he's giving me that stare. He's like, I'm a baby dragon. Rawr, I will tear you up. We're gonna send out Hishi again and uh, try and heal the paralysis because we don't have uh, we don't have XP share on, so he she won't get the experience anyway. Fighting versus fighting. Hmm. Cherry, we'll use lava cookie. But um, yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> Oh no, that was close. That scared me. <laughs> my hair stood up on my arms and I was like, oh no, 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 no. No more close calls. That was another episode. This one is... No. <laughs> oh, why did I send him out? He's... Okay. We're gonna use assurance. Come on, Clutch. Oh no, he knocked off. Yep, he knocked off the black glasses. Now Assurance isn't going to do that much damage. Oh, it still killed him, though. Okay, thank God. He knocked off the black glasses, so I got scared. I was like... Why am I getting so scared this episode? I didn't get scared that he knocked off the black glasses. I was like, oh no, now I'm not going to be doing enough damage. Okay, so... Okay, he's holding them again. Great. Oh, we're at this part. Mm -hmm. I can smell it. I can smell it right here. The scent of adventure. This is definitely one. It's got to be a secret spot. There'll be enough space here to build a crazy super place. Or well, my name's not Arun. <laughs> His music's so cheery for a guy so serious. Yo, my young... Oh, I got him. Yo, my young trainer. What can I do for you? Hmm? Huh? What do you mean you didn't ask for anything? Bet your heart did. 
Now, now, no need to be shy. After all, we I shook the camera. I'm sorry. You were never born and 25 years old. Spent the last 11 years trying to find myself a vagabond in search of dreams. I'm wandering around Hoenn trying to find a place I really belong. That's right, a super, the super, super brace. What kind of life is that? Too sad, little bro. I'm skipping all my texts now. You ain't gonna get to hear it, but take this TM anyway. It'll help you make secret bases. Secret bases will make places to live. You know what I'm saying, cuz? You can just climb right up in this tree. You see that? Get real comfy, make your base, and we all good, man. Well, looks like this is where our base is gonna be for now. <laughs> we'll make a... In between episodes, I'll make a better base. And start the next episode off there. We'll probably be swapping areas a lot, though, <laughs> to be honest. Come on, tell Uncle Aro what you say when you're totally thrilled. Hmm... I say... Oh, it doesn't stay caps for a while. Okay. I say Yoss. Yoss! Yoss! That's good. Know why I asked you that? Isn't it obvious? Because I can already see there's plenty of future to feel about. You know what I'm saying? Every day is full of adventures. Oh, yeah! Hmm, now I can go ahead and make a secret base right here. I guess I'm gonna leave this spot for you. There's hair on my screen. I don't know why. Whatever floats your boat, right? Oh, right. Decorating. See, any decorations you get will be sent to your PC. Then you can use them to liven up this place. That's your PC, fool. But there's a PC. I already said that. Here, have these decorations to get started out. Oh, right. One last thing. You can do more than make your own secret base. You can visit others. So, this is where things get interesting, actually. Um. Meh. Um. We'll take time to do this, I guess. Send a, uh. I'm trying to think. Send a pic of uh, your secret base QR code, and we will visit it and battle your trainer in a video to our Instagram. I will put it in the description below. Well, no, wait. We won't put that flower. Screw flowers. Um, I'm trying to think right now. That looks stupid. There we go. <laughs> I'm trying to think about what I'll do. Um... Not that, that's for sure. Put the poster above the bed. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's PD9000 as a baby! <laughs> and it's the other two starters that didn't get picked. <laughs> Worn out light. We'll put that over here. And that's it. Yep. Yes, I'm done decorating. Now we can heal from in here because of that bed. PD! It's you! It's really PD! It's PD's reincarnation. Boom, so we healed up here. Nice. We've done some stuff. <laughs> We're gonna try not to battle this girl. Don't battle, no battle. Okay, so I don't think there's anything, any spots where you're able to catch stuff on this route. So, uh, do I have to battle you? No, I don't, okay. We're gonna go on and we're gonna see what we can catch on this route. Ah, May. Hey. The road here was pretty long, huh? I got tired that I had to take a little break. I had- I got tired enough. KB's G, your Pokemon look pretty tired themselves. Let me take care of them. We just healed them! Quit doing things for the sake of the plot. There, that's all better. I'm on my way to 
pay a visit to Professor Cosmo. He's famous for his research on meteorites. He was working on a project with my dad, um, I mean, Professor Birch, on how meteorites might affect Pokemon. Enough dawdling. I don't think it's much further to Fall Arbor. Let's give it one last push. Later, May. One last push. What Pokemon are we gonna catch? It's gonna be a spin to watch. I am a psychic! <laughs> I wanted a Stormy! <laughs> Should we catch this or use it as cannon fodder? I'll catch it and find out if Spinda is good or not. <clears throat> That was... Okay. Come on. Yay! Boo -boo 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 okay, we caught the Spinda. I'll see if that Spinda's any good. Or if any Spinda's any good. It's got a unique pattern, though. I guess. I mean, no two Spinda's patterns are the same. But this one, yeah. All the Spinda that exist in the world are said to have utterly unique spot patterns. The shaky, tottering steps of this Pokemon give it the appearance of dancing. So I think we'll name you... It's a male. Sorry I don't talk while I'm nicknaming. <laughs> okay, we can't put spaces here. Mm, it's gonna barely fit. Drunken Dance. Drunken Dance has been transferred to Alive. He looks drunk. Can't deny it. Now we can't catch anything here, though. Ah, good trainer. Inevitable trainer battle. Please have, like, some normal types or something. Of course. Of course! <laughs> hmm. Karate chop. Oh, that didn't do as much as I- Oh. Okay. Seeing moves like that scare me. It doesn't matter what level the Pokemon is. Seeing something like used Earthquake, Magnitude, Bulldoze, stuff like that scare me. Because I'm like, oh, I'm about to die. He, she's about to level up. Oh, Electric, sweet. Or like Volt Switch. Volt Switch had us running for our money in the gym. Like, it almost got Dreamer. We're gonna use Revenge on this thing. Because I knew it was gonna go first. Nice. He good a level twenty four. Pew stinks. Ill. You smell like poop. Ah, Jesus Christ! What? The From out the ashes, I leap. Yeah, I challenge thee. I really hope Hishi's speed is lower than this thing's. Yes. Ooh, Avenge coming in with that stab. Plus, it does extra damage. Seismic Toss! Ooh, I predicted that we would go faster this time. The reeds! The hard reeds! About to send out another coughing. We'll just keep fighting with uh, Hishi. Hishi's doing really good. Huh. We got poison. That's not good. Oh, that's really not good. That's scaring me right now. <laughs> Everything is scaring me today. 
Oh no, that did nine damage. Would I like to switch out? No. <laughs> I know somebody who's watching this just called me stupid, but I was planning on switching out after he she stayed in the battle to get that experience. And now Clutch will level up. That did barely anything. Use Assurance. I got that Stab plus Black Glasses. And he used Poison Gas. Oh, that did 10 damage. The Poison does more damage than the Pokemon does. Finish him off with Bite. And that's the battle. It's done and over with. Clutch leveled up. He's going to learn Scary Face now. Forget Howl, learn Scary Face. Boom. He, she got the experience too. With honor, I admit defeat. Old man, little boy. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, remember to like to share your support. Remember to comment. Remember to uh, go to our Instagram. I think... I haven't been on our Instagram in a while. It's... KV's... I think it's just KV's Gaming. The Instagram is just at KV's Gaming. Either that or it's at KV's underscore gaming. Something along the lines of that. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm very forgetful today. But remember to go there and uh, send us QR codes through uh, DM us your QR codes or make po posts and uh, hashtag KV's Gaming secret bases or Pokemon Omega Ruby KV's. Something like that. Just do a clever hashtag that'll recognize KV's Gaming. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, remember to like, comment, your nickname suggestions, your rule suggestions, and if you went to our Instagram and did the QR code thing a bobber. Yeah, this is K out.